Okay, welcome for those of you who stuck around for this sixth one. It's all about adding taxes. It simply is a nice further step to this discussion about government spending because if you're going to have government spending, you're going to have taxes. And in this extra step your professors might take, what they're going to do is talk about consumption in a little greater detail. They're going to say C isn't equal just to A plus B why they're going to say C is equal to A plus B times income minus the amount of income, which is a fraction, T, times your income. So what's happening? This is the new element. And what they're doing is they're taking money away from this consumer. They're taxing them. That's what that little T is, a fraction. So T is greater than zero and less than one. They're going to, the government's going to tax you. It's like an income tax, isn't it? They might tax you 10% of your income, and so they take that away from your income. So you spend a certain portion of your disposable income. People might call that YD, disposable income. What do you have left? You have some income minus what they tax you. And that's it, really. And now the rest is just some simple algebra to give you a new multiplier. So we have Y, which is how much the economy makes, equals A plus B times Y minus ty, right, that's the little ty, plus i plus g. That's our new equation. This stuff here is all that c stuff with the new taxes in it, and the rest is the same. And the problem algebraically becomes the same kind of thing. You simply want to collect all your y terms. Let's do this as simply as possible. y equals a plus by minus BTY plus I plus G. I just put the B, I multiplied B times Y and B times negative TY. And now I'm going to bring all those terms that have the Y's in them back over to this side. So we end up with Y minus BY. See, I'm subtracting BY from here and those cancel out. And now I've got to add a BTY over here. So I add B T y and if I add a BTY over here, those cancel out. So all that stuff's gone. So this stuff equals A plus I plus G. And so now we have these terms with Y and we pull the Y out of this long equation here. We get Y, Y, that's a 1 minus B plus BT equals A plus I plus G. We're getting close now, aren't we? Because what we're doing is formulating a new multiplier. It's a new multiplier that will uh, describe what the multiplier is with taxes. Anyway, so we take y here, and we multiply this side by 1 over 1 minus b plus. So that gets rid of that, gets rid of that term, which is down here. And we now go to y equals 1 over 1 minus b plus B, T, that's the tax multiplier when taxes are included, times all of this stuff, A plus I plus G. So now when you change government spending, you have to use a new multiplier. And that's what this thing is here. 1 over 1 minus B plus B, T becomes the new tax multiplier. So, uh, you know, you have to know the tax rate, that's what the little t is, and you have to know the marginal propensity to consume, that's what the b is, and now you change g to fill a gap, and now you've got a gap equals the change in g times this new multiplier, and you can fill in the, the, the numbers and work out what you have to change g by. It's still the gap divided by this new multiplier equals the change in g. That's about it. Like I said, you know, this stuff is tough to generalize because different teachers will emphasize different things. I think the main focus for me, and mo mostly to get this equation and what it's all about, is that Keynesian philosophy that consumers respond to the market due to psychological reasons as well as prices. Business people respond to the market with psychological reasons as well as prices. And if they are not spending or doing something that brings us to full employment, then G steps in and increases spending. Anyway, that's the tax multiplier. We could go on and on with this stuff, but I think I'll end it there. Um, 
Hope I didn't go too far with you, but uh, I enjoy this particular bit of algebra. It's the most fun algebra I've done. Okay, anyway, see you around.